G'day YouTube. Lego have revealed the Lego Ideas Jaws set that's coming out. And I gotta say, this one's caught me a bit off guard. It's coming out on August the 6th and it looks splendid. It literally does look splendid. Like it's like it's it's one of those things where Lego goes to town on Lego Ideas sets. They are absolutely out of this world, thinking Wally, -E, thinking so many other sets. Um thinking Orient Express is an example of where compromises are made sadly but let's not talk about that one so this one comes in at 1497 pieces and I've, i just want to say it just looks absolutely brilliant let's zoom in on the uh, photos and get a bit more detail in there but really really cracking looking set look at that the jaws i mean you know shark's not the easiest shape to make and and i think they've actually really caught that like him coming out of the water there with that piece they've used for the eye just really does remind me of the movie and you've got to remember this is from a movie that you know the effects were limited by what they had at the time and it was bloody scary when it came out but a lot of it was done because you couldn't actually see the shark very often that was part of the suspense of the movie so when you did see the shark it was a little robotic and actually that's pretty pretty spot on so i don't think they were going for a realistic looking shark they were going for a movie accurate shark which they have definitely done there and the ship is uh, this set's worth it for the ship like i wish they'd just sell the ship to be perfectly honest i don't want the rest of it i just want the ship because the ship is absolutely brilliant it really does capture the movie with the the barrels and the suicide plank off the front that's what i should have called it because there's no way you'd go out on that with that shark there and the three characters there fighting for their life against the shark this really does show though how much lego is going for adult builders these days because you can't sell that to a kid like it wouldn't mean anything it would mean something to you know generations like me who've actually watched the movie many many times but going through, I do like the uh, the artwork there. I mean, it's very Lego ideasy with the frame around it and the, the way they've done the dark tone because a lot of this was done sort of at dark times. There were night scenes, there were day scenes, but I think that like there's a good compromise there. It does look really, really terrifying, and I love the white foam really pops on that box coming out there. That classic Jaws logo kudos to lego for going in here there, there we go different slightly different view i mean that shark really does look quite wooden doesn't it but it does the job it's exactly what it needs to be for this set that terrifying massive shark that's the size of a boat coming out to attack this little fishing boat there and you can see you know start to see some of the details on that boat from this angle it looks really really good I personally wouldn't be sitting there with a fishing rod with that giant shark, but that's just me, you know. I wasn't in the movie. Looking at the boat from another angle, we can see they've just crammed in so many little details. There's that bell at the top. We've got the spears down the side. We've got what must be the shark cage that they go down in. I do like how the ladder has been done there with hoses by the looks of it to make that shape work. It looks really, really good really good loving so much of that it just looks superb ah lego stop doing this to me i'm running out of kidneys to sell whoa whoa okay now we're getting to the meat of it that is a fantastic photo it's obviously been rendered i very much doubt that's a uh, actual photo but it just looks they that they've nailed that that's so good in <laughs> his face his face, I've got to say, some brown stuff would come out if that was me, but you know, that's just me. You can see the barrels in the water. Yep, that shark looks terrifying from that angle. I love it, love it, love it, love it. And there's the shark flying. I like this. I like the fact that they've actually, they've made this appeal to people like me where you can actually display the shark. Um, I like the fact that you know it's got some tonsils or something going on inside the mouth as well. They haven't skimped on the details there. That's awesome, really good. Ah, just like like that. And then we've got the three, the three guys trying to capture the shark. The uh, the lead fisherman. I didn't look up the names before the before the show before this video, so I can't remember their exact names. But yeah, yeah, I think they've done well. Those faces, those expressions. The the hard. I'm the tough seaman look there the doofus scientist who i think is actually played by a guy called rufus something anyway 
and then we've got the police officer kind of guy who's trying to stop everybody getting eaten <laughs> i do like it yes yes lego this is good i like the fact that you've <clears throat> got a way to display the shark separately like this so people like me can use the boat in my city excellent kudos for that one yep a bit more detail on the back i like this i mean i wonder what happens to the base at this point like you've got this massive base that that uh, you can't really do anything with once you separate it. I mean, the only thing that comes off is the name plaque, obviously, on the side of the box that goes down here onto the onto the side of the shark. But what a wonderful set. What a wonderful set. Thoughtful. Um, I'm not going to pick on the lifestyle pictures because there's usually like, you know, <laughs> let's not go there. <laughs> but I like this. Look at this. It's going onto the inside of the boat. That's great with the map bit of interior detail getting really up close this boat is i don't know if i mentioned this or not but that boat's wonderful it's really good really good lego you're gonna need a bigger boat yep definitely are oh, not seen the movie obviously it's a quote from the movie um yeah great display set great set to use in your city that's a fantastic fishing boat um I don't know if you'd use the jaws so much, although actually going back, let's just go back a second. I just noticed something that explains what I saw on that box there. Yeah, of course, because here we've got the entire shark with the tail, whereas here it's actually just the front section of the shark. That's right. That makes sense. So, yeah, if you if you look at the sort of the box, you've got half the shark and then in the, when it's stood up, they've actually added the tail in. So you get extra pieces in this set. That's interesting. So effectively, you've got a giant base that you're not going to use if you're going to display the shark, or you've got half a shark if you're going to display it as the display set. Interesting. So lots of parts coming out of this set is my takeaway from that. Um, but looks brilliant. Like, love the detail. Love it. This is really good. This is good stuff, Lego. Oh, run out of photos. Um, yeah, looking forward to this one. Um, I'd love to add this to my collection. Um, just not sure how much kidneys are going for these days because Lego has released a few too many sets. <laughs> Stop, slow down. Um, but I love it. Let me know what you think in the comments though. I'd love to know if you are keen on this set or are you going to get it. Um, this is definitely on my wish list. Whether or not I get it is another question, but I would love to get this because it would look fantastic in my harbour and that shark would look terrifying on display. So why the hell not? <laughs> anyway, new here. Uh, give my channel a subscribe if you're feeling kind and you've enjoyed my commentary on this set and uh, Give the video a like please. It does help me in the YouTube Algorithms actually I just noticed there's some shark teeth on the front of that boat as well, which is rather well done Very nice. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you again very soon. Thanks for watching